Welcome to our R programming tutorial. Today, we're tackling a question that many data analysts encounter when working with POSIX seed fields in R. Our viewer is trying to expand the number of factors displayed in a custom POSIX seed field, but despite their efforts, they only see two values instead of the expected 20. Let's dive into the details and find out how to overcome this challenge. Welcome back to another tech video. Today we're going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Guys, remember to stay a little bit crazy like me and find that resolution. Now, let's continue on. To expand the number of factors shown in a custom POSIX field in R, we need to adjust the parameters of the star function. Let's start by loading our data. Next, we will define a custom class for our datetime format. This allows R to correctly interpret the datetime strings in our dataset. Now that we have our data loaded and the custom class defined, we can use the star function to display the structure of our data frame. However, we want to ensure that we see more than just two entries for our post exit field. If you still see limited output, consider adjusting the terminal width settings. This can sometimes restrict how much data is displayed. Finally, if you want to show the number of items per variable without expanding the parameters, you can use the summary function to get a concise overview. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To expand the output of a POSIX CT field in R, you can adjust the default width using the Options function. This controls how many columns are printed when displaying data frames. You can also set a specific width directly in the steer function. Make sure to provide a large enough value to accommodate your data. When using the star function, the output is limited by both the vec.len and the width parameters. Adjust these to see more elements in your output. In summary, by adjusting the width in options or directly in the star function, you can effectively expand the display of POSIX seat fields in R. And that's it guys. We've gone through, found the solutions, and hopefully answered your query. If it did, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. And until next time, hope you have a good one. Cheers.